Digestive disorders are basically disease states of the organs that are involved with digestion. So that includes your mouth, your esophagus, your stomach, your small bowel, and your large bowel, rectum, and anus. So some of the most common digestive disorders are peptic ulcer disease, and, and that's when we develop a little sore inside of our stomach or our small bowel, um, and that can be related to an infection, or it can be related to aspirin or non-steroidals, which we take for joint pain. Um, other things could be gastroesophageal reflux, which is very common, and that happens when we, our gastric context, which is very acidic, um, washes up into our esophagus, and our esophagus does not like that acidity, so we wind up uh, presenting with pain or heat or a burning sensation that goes up from our abdomen up to our chest. Um, other things such as uh, constipation, where we're not going to the, we're not emptying out our, our bowels at an appropriate amount, or diarrhea, where we're emptying them out too quickly. Um, the other thing is colon cancer, which is fairly common, but uh, with screening colonoscopies, we're actually doing a good job with decreasing the amount of colon cancer. Um, hepatitis or hepatitis C and B or viral infections of the liver. Um, pancreatitis is inflammation of the pancreas, and that can come from uh, drinking too much alcohol or from other viral causes. So what's involved with the digestive system is all the organs that are involved with digestion.